Hey, what's up everyone? Sam Carlson from SpawnRoom.com with another uh, eSports Bulletin, episode number 8 for June 15th, 2012. We're going to start this one off with MLG News, or MLG, probably the last piece of MLG News. Um, they've released their uh, Spring Championship viewer figures in a nice big fancy infographic, so you can go check that out online. It's all over the place. Um, 437,000 peak concurrent. 4.7 million uniques over the weekend with uh, Championship Sunday pulling in 2.2 million of those alone. They also had 20,000 live spectators and $200,000 in prizes or about that much. Uh, this made it the largest North American uh, esports tournament to date and probably one of the best esports events overall. I thought it was a lot of fun. It was crazy. It was, it was really good. Um, so yeah, that's cool. That's really, really cool. Uh, next up is Bar Dota, a play on the Barcraft phenomenon, which is organizing in Munich, Germany, for the DreamHack Dota 2 Vengeance Cup. Obviously, there'll be a lot of other, you know, bar crafts and uh, bar leagues or bar laws or whatever they're called, and you know, uh, but this is the first official like Dota 2 Barcraft style event that's been reported. So that's cool. Um, yeah. Anyway, you can go uh, check this out. Uh, this was posted on ESFI World. But uh, you can also go to dreamhack.se for event information and streams. That's this weekend, so go check it out. And finally, Counter-Strike 1.6 is being removed from Intel Extreme Masters after six successful seasons. So that's sad news for all the Counter-Strike players out there. Uh, however, they did say that uh, 1.6 will, you know, may still show up at local or regional tournaments, depending on, you know, if there's a lot of pros in that area or whatever. Uh, and they also did not mention whether Global Offensive or some other FPS title will take its place. They just said that, well, we're po probably removing 1.6, so... World Cyber Games is also rumored to be doing the same thing, so... I'd say Counter-Strike 1.6 is pretty much on the down and out. Uh, you can read the original press release at esl-world.net forward slash masters. So that uh, covers it for this eSports Bulletin, and we'll see you at the next one. Thanks for watching.